Hey guys, it's Kylie, and to me you might be noticing that my filming setup is a little different today. I decided to film in my kitchen just because it has so much good natural lighting, and it's just so open, so it's kind of easier to move around. And also, if we're being honest with ourselves, I'm home alone, and I'm scared to be upstairs by myself because I'm a wimp like that. Anyway, this week's theme on Just Fangirl Things is our daily makeup routine. The way this video is going to work is I'm going to show you the products I will be using on my face, kind of explain them and give a brief review, and then actually do, say like if I was explaining foundation, I would say this is my blah 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 foundation, I really like it, and then I would start to apply the foundation. Also, I don't wear makeup every day, but when I do, these are the steps I complete to do my makeup look. My face is absolutely clean of any makeup now, so let's just get started. I already went ahead and primed my face for you guys because that's not very exciting, and I did that using the Mini Benefit Pore Professional. The first thing I'm going to be doing today is applying concealer. I'm going to use this Maybelline Instant Age Ray Wine Concealer and apply it under my under eye circles and on any blemishes. After that, I'm just going to go ahead and blend it in. Right now, I'm just doing a quick sweep under both my eyes and then I'm just gonna put a little on any kind of imperfections. After I apply my concealer, I just blend it in with my fingers. I know some people like to use a beauty blender, but I tried and I found it doesn't blend as effectively as if I were to use my fingers. The next step in my makeup routine is to apply foundation. The foundation I use is called Maybelline Dream Look Good Mousse and it's in the color Ivory. I'm just going to squirt some of this out onto my hand and apply it all over my face. Usually the way I like to apply my foundation is to just do little dots all over my face like that and then blend it in all at once. And once again, I'm just gonna blend this in with my hands. The last thing I usually apply to my face is powder. The powder I'm going to be using today is another Maybelline product and this is the Maybelline Dream Wonder Powder and the shade Ivory. I'm just going to be taking my Precision Beauty powder brush and dusting the powder all over my face. Normally I like to apply a lot of powder for even coverage, but today I'm just going for a lighter look. That's all the makeup I usually put on my face, but now I'm going to move on to my eyes. The first thing I do is apply an eyeshadow primer, and this one is the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. I'm just going to be applying this all over my eyelid, and what this does is make sure that the eyeshadow stays on longer and the colors are more vivid. When I'm doing my eyeshadow, I almost always use the Maybelline Nudes palette. This is very similar to the Urban Decay Naked palette, only it has way more colors. This is the color I'm going to be using today to put on my lids. I'm just going to be using my eyeshadow brush and dusting this across both of my eyelids. I just learned something about myself, and that is that I cannot apply my eyeshadow on camera. When I watched that back, I realized that I was totally off of my eyelid, and also I showed you guys the wrong color. This is the actual color I used on my lid. The color that I showed you before and said it was for my eyelids is the color I'm going to be using in my crease. I'm just going to be doing the same thing with the eyeshadow, only putting it in the crease of my eye instead of over my eyelids. After I finish my eyeshadow, I do my eyeliner. For my eyeliner today, I'm just going to be using the Maybelline Unstoppable Liner. This is too hard for me to do on camera, so I'll be right back. I just finished applying the Maybelline Unstoppable Eyeliner in the color Espresso to my waterline. If it looks like I'm crying, I probably am because, guys, I literally cry every single time I do eyeliner. It's really weird. Once eyeliner is done, the only thing left to do for my eyes is mascara. For my mascara today, I'm just going to take my Maybelline Lash Stiletto and apply it to my lashes. This is actually one of my favorite mascaras, and the main reason I like it is because of the brush. It's super skinny, and it's easy to get mascara on all of my lashes instead of just a few. The last thing I do to complete my routine is apply lip gloss. Today I'm going to be using the Maybelline Color Elixir in the shade Petal Push. It's just a really pretty sheer pink color. I'm just going to apply this all over my lips for a nice glossy shine. This is my finished makeup look. I really hope you guys enjoyed and I hope that by filming this video I give some of you at least one makeup tip or ideas on how to do your makeup. I just want to put, out, put it out there that I'm not being sponsored or partnered with in any way by Maybelline even though I use a ton of their products in this tutorial. They're just my favorite makeup line and they have really great quality stuff. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and remember to follow, comment, and subscribe. Bye!